A data processing unit, or DPU, is often referred to as the third major chip alongside central processing units and graphics processing units. Its function is to relieve the burden of the CPU and is used in scenarios that require ultra-low latency and large throughputs, such as financial computing, high-performance computing, and automatic driving. Beijing-based Ruser Technology recently developed China's first DPU chip. This is China's first DPU chip with fully independent intellectual property rights. It is based on 28 nanometer process and can support a wide range of applications, including networks, storage, and big data. Its network has bandwidth 200 gigabits and a processing delay of just 1.2 microseconds, making it a leader in technical performance not only in China, but globally. Recently, the U.S. has escalated chip sanctions against China. On December 16, the U.S. Department of Commerce listed 36 Chinese science and technology companies and research institutions, including Yangtze Memory and Cambricoin, on its trade blacklist. This has pushed Chinese researchers to invest heavily in research and development. The DPU project developed by Ruser Technology has undergone extensive review, with over 60 program reviews completed. The chip's front end alone required the writing of nearly 400,000 lines of code. Despite external pressures, the domestic market continues to show strong demand for chips, which has encouraged us to prioritize research and development efforts. To that end, we applied all our available resources to developing core technology and improving production. The rapid growth of industries such as new energy vehicles, data centers, and photovoltaic in 2022 has led to an increase in demand for chips. According to a market report from Semiconductor Equipment and Materials International, global semiconductor equipment shipments reached nearly 29 billion U.S. dollars in the third quarter, up 9% month-on-month and 7% year-on-year.